Welcome everyone, Legends here, and today guys I am basically going to be showing you how I use Sony Vegas or how I edit my video, which is with Sony Vegas. Now I'm basically going to be showing just the beginning steps, there won't be a face cam for this, just because I don't want to get confused when I edit it myself. So, if you guys want more advanced, basically more advanced ways to like edit and stuff, I guess just leave a comment down below. But the first thing that I like to do every single time I get to ready, get ready to edit a video, I like to get all the stuff. I kind of have everything in folders on my computer. As you guys can see, a bunch of folders everywhere. First thing I go to is the four Sony Vegas folder that has my intro in it. So I'm gonna go ahead and back out. So I already clicked and dragged on there, or you can go file open. I mean, I'm not trying to show you guys how to use it. I'm pretty sure people know how to use it. I'm just showing you how I edit. After that, I like to go to my in-game shout outs and get my outro and like my face cam overlay, my like button, my subscribe, Twitter, all that. I usually don't use the Twitter and subscribe that too often. So I'd like hit these is what I'm usually just pulling and click and drag, boom, there we go. After that's done, it's in here. I like to obviously get the video that you want to go or the video that you want to post on YouTube. I get that in here. So I'm just going to choose probably the one that went up yesterday. What did, what went up yesterday? I forgot what one. Um, I think it was here face. Yeah, the higher, lower one. Um, I'm going to actually get the, that was the face cam of it. So I'm going to go and get the actual video of it, which is... If I can find it, find it, find it. I am lost right there. Right here it is. Boom. So once I got the video, I got my intro, I got everything that I want into the project. I make sure I have everything in here. The last thing I do, which you haven't seen yet, is um, background music, but that's not the most important. I like to just click like my videos onto the track. I usually, uh, I'll get the face cam. Oops, I forgot the face cam. I'll show you guys how I do my face cam as well. Files, go get the face cam for this. It's actually kind of confusing. Are you like the syncing up is kind of the hardest for me not necessarily i like to put the face cam where the show is and this below it just so i'll be able to sync it up a little bit better after that i like to disable the resample basically that's making sure it's not blurry or whatnot so i just click right click go to switches and disable like there was another way you can go to the properties and do it all that but this was easier and then i like to sync up so wherever this all starts I'll sync it all together. So let's look at, listen to this. One legend. One legend. Whoa. So it's like right here. I'm not gonna make it perfect. This video isn't gonna be a perfect sync. So split off the extra, delete it, and then I just hold shift and hit the top of them, hit G, and then it'll group it all together. So now it does not mess up. Everything should stay in sync. One legends here. And today, guys, I'm like one legend. As you can today, tell, guys, I'm it's kind of laggy today, because guys, I have all this stuff open to record here. this today, video. Guys. After that, guys, I like to, depending on what type of video, I can instantly start splitting it, cutting out, making a cut calm, depending on what I like to make. For this case, this video, it was just straight up face cam right there. So I have like everything preset it. I think it's not to like right here. Yeah, I decide that I'm not gonna have this. So I'm gonna sit here and just split this off as well last time. And then I'll come here to delete on my keyboard or you could have just right clicked and hit delete on the thingy. So go ahead and put that together. And this is basically where it had cut into the um face cam so you guys could see or the so you guys can see the my computer screen, that's what I cut in. So basically I have a preset already. I'll just go here, hit the crop, go to face cam, boom, it's in the corner. And it's something else I like to do, guys. Something that I don't think you guys pay too much attention to is make a blurred background now. I don't have a good camera. People I had a comment a long time ago when I first did it that my camera quality was really good. I really don't have a good good camera. So if you guys want a in-depth tutorial on how to do so just comment down below and i'll do that for you guys basically in order to unlink one from this group just hit u and then you'll be able to do it so like for instance all this is linked together but if i come up here hit u on my keyboard it releases this and i hit copy why not copy uh hit u and it would release it you see and i'm gonna go ahead and control z that and control z it again so now it's all grouped together put it back and basically that's about it i go on from here uh put in my 
face cam overlay this is mine personally that i've made in photoshop yes i still work with photoshop even though i can't do thumbnails i go ahead and put the face cam border boom instantly i do like my blurred background and like i said if you guys want to see that uh, tutorial on how to do get blurred background just let me know and i'll show you how i do it and then i just from here on guys i just go and start cutting where i don't want it i'm just cutting them just to show you guys and then when i'm all done say that's all i want to do for it first i'll just go here get the picture whatever you call it then i get the music the song that i use stretch it out and then i'll import my latest video put it in there cut it down and that is about it that is what i do to edit a video this depends on the type of video it's a little bit different steps sometimes i add background music sometimes i won't guys so that's gonna be it for this video it's just a quick simple video like i said if you want to see more advanced tutorial like my exact settings for sony vegas or if you guys want to see how i get the blurred background because as you guys can tell it's just normal nothing's blurred in this one but usually in all my videos it is just let me know in the comment section below hopefully you guys enjoyed watching this video hopefully this comes out good and thank you for subscribing thank you for the support i'm so close to 1.3k i keep going and up and down i don't know what's going on but thank you guys for everything it mean a lot to me if you tell everybody just to give me a chance that's all i ask and i say that every single time thank you goodbye i'm the realest one that's repping oh my god oh my god if i die i'm a legend when they lay me down to rest i know i was always